Hi! That's a really good one. Ooh. Important for all kind of different sits. See? This way around. That's awesome. Oh. Hi, just a quick video. Let's do some unboxing and mailbag. Oops. Mm. Let's start with this one here. Mm. Great. This is an old Alps potentiometer. It has 500 kilo ohms and it has uh, a so called Mittelanzapfung. The English term is. Oh, what is the English term? And the shaft is slotted, if this is the correct term. Eine geschlitzte Achse. I've bought them as a replacement for the Pioneer SM83 tube amplifier. Next one. Oh, that's neat. Classical Siemens MKH design. A great cap. Let's have a look at the Q factor. The capacitance is fine. Yes, the Q factor is good. That's a really good one. Everything fine. I can really recommend you these caps. They are great for uh, repair and service of old tube equipment. Okay, this is for a different project. The German term is Hohlbuchse. Uh, what's the correct English term? Uh, DC plug? Maybe. This is not the highest quality you can get. Next one. Ah, okay. This is slightly better. I have a Denon DAC digital analog converter. And it has this uh, tiny DC power supply. And I want to give it a better power supply, but I don't want to cut off the cable. This will be a different story and you will see it on YouTube soon. Next one. This one comes from Reichelt, a great supplier for electronic uh, equipment and stuff and parts and so on. I can really rec... I can really rec... I can really recommend it. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Hold on. Oh, come on. Haha! <laughs> Können wir es schaffen? Yo, wir schaffen das! A helmet is very important for all kind of different situations. A helmet is very important for all kind of different situations. Sit A helmet is very important for all kind of different situations. Come on! Situ situ situations. Uh, what's wrong with you? A helmet is very important for all kind of different applications. <laughs> situations. An example. If you...
if you're eating, it is very important to have a helmet. Mm. See? There. And without the helmet. Ow! What else do we have? Catalog. Nice. But this one is something I can recommend to you. A lot of parts, and this is not a paid uh, advertising or so. I, I just like Reichelt, okay? They have so many parts and uh, exotic things or cool things, cheap things for makers, for electronic uh, professionals and uh, for hobbyists. Good stuff. Printing paper. And this is so cool. These are test clips from Hirschmann. And okay, I will reuse this cardboard box. Next one. This is from Adam Hall. This is the best cable die you can possibly get. So how does it work? Here we have a product, okay? This cable. We start here. Okay. Then this way round. It's very easy, really. And here out. And go. And now it's fixed. And if you want to move it, simply turn it clockwise, okay, or counterclockwise, uh, and you can move it. This is so great. Okay, this is how it works. Cool. But be aware, there are some very cheap Chinese uh, products with the Velcro on both sides. And this does not work. So you need this side of the Velcro here and the other side on the opposite. Also, there are these corners. I need them for my subwoofers. And more hardware. Cool. So this is the last one for today. I have no idea what it is. But the packing year, yeah, it's not great. Oh, beautiful. This is part of a patch bay, a beautiful patch bay. Beautiful. Now that's great, isn't it? But now they are obsolete because they were built for analog video and now you have HD and here now you have 4K and soon you have 
8K and so on. So they throw them out. And I've got it pretty cheap on eBay. Look at the quality of these connectors. That's awesome. Wow. There's a 75 ohms resistor. And now enjoy this sound. Oh. Excellent. So, what do you think? Would you like to see more of such videos? Short ones, but more often? If yes, give it a big thumbs up. This helps me a lot for motivation. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye.